depending on the nature of the emergency call, one or more of the dispatch police, dispatch fire engine and dispatch ambulance task is immediately initiated. Hi, my name is Andreas Hense and this video is part of a series on BPMN and workflow patterns. Today we look at the multi-choice pattern. The divergence of a branch into two or more branches such that when the incoming branch is enabled, the thread of control is immediately passed to one or more of the outgoing branches based on a mechanism that selects one or more outgoing branches. You can see the behavior in the original flash animation. So here we execute task A and then we choose the top branch and go to task B. In the second case we choose the bottom branch and go to task C. And finally in the third case we choose both branches and go to tasks B and C. In BPMN this can be modeled in three different ways. The first way is with a splitting inclusive gateway. So answer emergency call. After that we ask the question what do we need and in this case we choose police and ambulance and not fire engine and then we go to dispatch police and dispatch ambulance. There is in fact an issue with this gateway. It is ensuring that at least one of the branches is selected. BPMN has an approach to partly solve this problem. It is called a default flow and denoted by a small dash on the arc as can be seen here. This is the default branch to be chosen if all other conditions evaluate to false. In this case it is the police. The second way is with an implicit split with conditions on the arcs. The token simulation only shows the case where all conditions are evaluated to true. The third way is with a complex gateway. Although this can be done, it is not advisable in this case because the complex gateway should only be used for behavior that is not captured by other gateways. The token simulations we have found do not support the complex gateway. Thank you for watching.